Hi everyone, this is the TANSET 2019 MBA question paper order video solution, data sufficiency question. This is a logical reasoning question, data sufficiency format. This is the seating arrangement questions, that is the DS format. Interesting question, medium difficulty question, let us get started. Right? So, this is a question, more like question, let us look at the statements. Answer options and then path it, then let us look at the statements one at a time. The question is, who among A, B, C, D and E, Anjiver A, B, C, D, E, this who among them is exactly in the middle when they are arranged in ascending order of their heights. Aungla, the shortest to tallest, ascending order la arrange pannu na, idhaan shortest na edhukna, idhaan tallest na edhukna, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, ipidhi yungla arrange pannu na, who is in the middle, third place la yaar irukkaanga, abdiin kettu kaanga. So, this is what the question is, statements apparama evaluate pannu pa paakla, let's quickly run through the answer options, because in the version over question ukk vera vera answer options kutthu irukkaanga. Choice A, is statement 1 alone is sufficient, 2 is not. Choice B, 2 alone is sufficient, 1 is not. C, in either 1 or 2 is sufficient. 1 matra sufficient are in 2 matra sufficient. Each statement is independently sufficient are in Then we will go with C. Essentially, 1 noon thaniya answer kudukun, 2 noon thaniya answer kudukun. Abdi na, we will go with C. D is both 1 and 2 are sufficient. Enna artha na, thani thaniya and the statement sufficient illa. But rindu statement e combine pani no na, together the statements are sufficient. Abdi na, we will go with answer option D. So, we have clarity about what these answer options are. Let's quickly get started. In the KLV, we have to answer the data sufficient. And that is the first We will look at statement, each statements one at a time. What is the question? Who is in the middle place? Right? A, B, C, D, E, ascending order, arrange for no one. Yar in the middle place. That is the KLV. Answer is we are going to be saying A is in the middle place, B is in the middle place, E is in the middle place. So, we need to come up with who is in the middle place. Yar is in the middle place. Now, we will answer the question. When is the data sufficient? The data is sufficient in the mari A, E, in the mari or yaar in the swallow no na. The data is sufficient when you have a unique answer. One single alt swallow no. C is in the middle place. E is in the middle place. Abdin correcta one a one answer kurto na. Then the data is sufficient. Adi A yaar kla, ille E yaar kla. Abdin more than one answers kurto na. Then the data is not sufficient. So we know what kind of a question, what kind of an answer we'll get, and when the data is sufficient. Idu morning the answer paniyach. So next step ande. Let's look at statement one. Statement 1 evaluate pundu mbodhu, let us evaluate statement 1 alone. Renda statement a paka koda paka adhingya. So, 1 alone sufficient on mola establish pundu la. Statement 1 la enna sulhi irukkaan, keldi yonu uruthana paathe inga, middle place la yaar irukkaan gaan kandu pidikinu. Statement 1, D is taller than B, but shorter than E. So, D koon, B and D koon enna relation irukkaan abdi inna sulhi irukkaan. Right. In the, in the statement eppidi nama evaluate pundu pundu na, counter example inga radhu. Counter example inna na, in the statement la irukkara data ava appidi vetsi kipo rung. இதே டேட்டாக்கு A middle இருக்கலாம் C middle இருக்கும் அப்படின் more than one answer கொண்டும் பிடித்தினார் இந்த example இது நடக்கும் இந்த caseல இது நடக்கும் அப்படின் more than one கொண்டும் நான் we will not have a unique answer in that case we can say the data is not sufficient from this statement அப்படி பண்ண முடிதான் மோல பார்க்கலாம் so we will start with the data given to us D is taller than B shorter ஆருக்கிறார்கள் left லடுதப் போரும் taller ஆருக்கிறார்கள் right லடுதப் போரும் so D is taller than B but shorter than E so D வந்து E வட short அனால D is to the left of E D is taller than B, அன்னால B ஓட rightல இருக்காம். So, இது வருக்கு clear. We want to look at two cases. Multiple cases இருக்கலாம். நம்ம் இரண்டு case பாத்து, இந்த caseல இந்த ஆள் middle இருக்காரே, இந்த caseல இவர் middle இருக்காரே, ஒரு unique answer வரலா, அப்படின் சொல்டும் நான் முடிந்தது. நமக்கு யார் பத்தி data அல்ல, A and C பத்தி data அல்ல. So, first, ஒரு example, I'm going to write A and C here. எங்க வணா A and C எடியிருக்கலாம். A and C பத்தி திரியானால் A is seen in the order லிடுதுனே. So, இப்பு யார் third placeல இருக்கா? 1, 2, 3. Third placeல, the person we have is C. So, if this is the way we arrange people, we get the answer C is in the middle. Let me see if we can get someone else also in the middle for this data holding good. The data is basically, D is taller than B and D is shorter than E. இதம் மாத்தவேல் A and C பத்தி நமக்கு என்னை திரியாது. So, A, C எப்படி மாத்திடியினா என்னாகும்? Still, we do not know anything about AC, but this data, D is taller than B and shorter than E is holding good. In here, that's one way. Now, who is middle? B, C, A. So, the person in the middle right now is A. So, one example, that is C middle. Another example, A middle. So, who is middle? We have more than one answer. That's why we have a unique answer. That's why we have a statement 1, we are not able to come up with a unique answer. Statement 1 alone is not sufficient. Quick, one alone is not sufficient. Why don't we eliminate it? One alone is not sufficient. A is obviously something that we can eliminate. We can eliminate one more. 
can eliminate answer option C also. In the independently, either one or two, Tani Tani Ave in the statement sufficient I reconcile the Rikan. Tani Tani and the statement sufficient I Statement one sufficient I learn, Tani Tani and the statement sufficient I reconcile the Mudia. So one not sufficient, A eliminate Pandra is very obvious. C A U eliminate Pandra because C would Arthur and one alone is sufficient, so is two alone sufficient. One sufficient I learn, render Tani Tani as sufficient I reconcile the possibility. So what is left? Answer option the B are two alone sufficient I learn. Ilana rendering combined mana the answer for number solar. Let's evaluate statement 2 alone to see whether 2 alone is sufficient, right? So, statement 2 evaluate pannu bode. Statement 1 na paakka koda paakka adhiya, right? Question anna, who is in the middle place? Statement 2 lana sulir kaanga, C is taller than B and D. C vandhi B and D evoda taller, but shorter than A. Avdiyan sulir kaanga. So, kitta thar naal veer pathi namakku vishyan therinji pojji pa, right? So, idhi yu counter example lana adhukku pannu. So, C a pathi anna sulir kaanga, taller than B and D. So, B e, even the enna order la irukkaanga theriyadhu, but namakku dhe eduthukla. So, C is taller than B and E, but shorter than A. So, in the statement, la the information correct. C is taller than B and E, but shorter than A. So, C is to the right of B and E, but to the left of A. Yara pati data thiriyadhe? D a pati data thiriyadhe. So, counter example I am going to take that D is in the middle. Still, the data holds good. C is taller than B and E, but shorter than A. D is in the middle place. So, this is the example. So, statement is holding good. So, C is in the data. Wa C is taller than B and D, but shorter than A. Ipa D enga place panna. We will go and place D in the end, right? which is also possible. Na, D, D could be the tallest person. So, now we have data. Varadhu. 1, 2, 3. The middle person happens to be C. So, D middle, larikla, C middle. Larikla. We got more than one answer by looking at statement 2 alone also. So, it's statement 2 may namak on the unique answer kudukla. 2 alone is not sufficient. Let us rule it out. So, 1 sufficient A and C eliminate pannya chen. If 2 sufficient A we will eliminate answer option B. So, correct answer is answer option D. Right. In the exam, in the question solve pannya chen. A, B, C eliminate pannya chen. D is the correct answer. Now, proceed pannya chen. If we class la irukkira nala, it is rendi me combine mani paathe. In a learning mode, let us check out together do they give us a unique answer. That is verify. We are just doing a verification process right now. Combining the two statements, D is taller than B but shorter than E. So, D is taller than B but shorter than E. In the statement, this is the same. C is taller than B and E. B and E are would C taller. Na, will definitely be taller than D also because D is shorter than E. E is shorter than C. So, D is the same. E would E when the C would have cotton sultan. So even an alaver with the theorem. Yet ever another little kanga. A is but shorter than A. C is shorter than A. A is going to be to the right of C. So Anjibera out of position may fix it. Yipa yar up a middle position or kanga. B, D, E. E is in the middle place. We got one single answer. Who is in the middle place now? E in a conclusive. End with a doubt to Lama Solomon. Therefore, together the statements are sufficient. Quickly run through this once more. Statement one learn the D, B, E. Abdina Dito. Statement 2 learn another you. C has to be to the right of B and D. After that, will definitely be to the right of D also. And C has to be to the left of A because C is shorter than A. So, Anjibir had a portion clear. You are middle and you E middle and you. Together, the statements are given as a unique answer. So, answer option is choice D. Together, B1 and 2 together are sufficient is the correct answer to the question.